Hi, this is Outstar, and I'm about to talk with ghosts. Hey, Google. Hey, Google. Talk to the Orpheus device. Sure, here's the Orpheus device. Greetings, Operative Dakota. It is a pleasure to be working with you again. We will be returning to case Zeta 0 2, the Martin residence. This is considered a low priority operation, yet you have spent a great deal of time here. For my records, is your access today authorized or personal? Personal. The Martins are a special case. I can understand why you'd want to visit them. Let us proceed. Calibrating. Capacitors charged. Shroud thinning operational and maintaining at 81%. Seeking test subject. Entity located. Designated Hector. Attempting to open communication. Oh. Hey. That's an interesting sensation. Someone's here, I think. It's not the kids. They're upstairs. And it's not you know who. Which means. Or someone else. If you're real. You are real, right? Yes or no? Yes. Well, nice to know I'm not hallucinating. This time, anyway. I'm telling you, there's gotta be a bottle around here somewhere. God knows there were enough tucked around the place. I was alive. With a drunkie. Well, I could cope, you know? Hey, you know what? I think maybe I kept one in the bathroom. Yeah. At least in the damn house I could get any damn privacy. Establishing contact. Who's there? I can't see you, but that doesn't mean I don't know you're here. Don't try to play games with me. You're not the first one to come snooping around my house. Wait a minute. Is that you, Coda? Answer me. Yes or no? No. You can't be too careful when it comes to letting strangers in. We had a robbery, you know, right before... Anyway, which one do you know? Hector? Gabriel? Really? Hector. <laughs> of course you know Hector. Hector meets such charming people. How do you know him, if I may ask? I know you're not a real friend, but that leaves all sorts of other options. So what are you? A drinking buddy? A workmate? Or a creditor? A drinking buddy. Of course. The only sorts of friends Hector had. So what did you two do while you were getting sloppy? Talk sports? Play chess? Or just sit there? Sit there? That sounds about right. I can see the two of you just sitting there. Whatever you look like. I suppose you can stick around if you'd like. For a little while, anyway. Don't touch anything, and whatever you do, be careful around Rosie. She likes to... Rosie, have you closed the bedroom door again? How many times have I told you not to do that? You open that door right now. Yes, Mommy. New presence detected. Tagging new presence as Rosie. You'll have to excuse me. I need to go have a little chat with my youngest. 
The entity is no longer responding. Connection dropped. Scanning for entities. Entities currently detected. Hector. Iris. Rosie. Which entity would you like to contact? Rosie. Initiating contact. I advise caution in talking to it. Mommy says I shouldn't play with strangers. But you seem nice. I'm playing with my dolls. Let's play with my dolls. Now this one is Mommy. And this one is Daddy. Though it's kind of broken. Uh, which one should we play with? Daddy. Hey, Daddy's in the living room. He's in this big plastic bag or something. Gabriel comes and rips it up so Daddy can get out. Looks weird and dark. I, I mean, da Daddy doesn't like it. There's a gun on the floor near the bottle of Daddy's favorite drink. Daddy wants to drink the bottle? Or take the gun. Take the gun? Are you sure? That doesn't sound like Daddy at all. But okay. The game. Daddy tries to take the gun, but surprise! His hand goes right through it. He says it feels like pins and... Gabriel tries to pick it up, too. Daddy tells him not to touch it. Gabriel never listens to Daddy anymore. Besides, he says it's his gun. That makes Daddy upset. He wants to know why Gabriel has a gun. What does Gabriel say? Was it for protection or to kill himself? <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, for protection. Gabriel says he got it to protect the house against burglars and stuff. Then he laughs. Doesn't sound like he's happy when he laughs, though. Then, he says he got it from a friend at school. 